Hi there, I'm so delighted to have you back on my channel. In today's edition of my short Excel tips, I'm going to show you how to add hours to time in Excel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time visiting my channel and don't forget to turn on post notification so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. In today's tip, I'm going to show you exactly what you get when you add an hour to what a time. So when you add eight hours to the current time, so this time is being picked from my PC. It's currently what 1040 over here. If I double click here and I load, it's going to update. So this time over is dynamic. It's going according to my PC time. Okay. So anytime you come reload, it's going to change your time. In order to get this time, just double click and type equal to now and then open and close bracket and hit enter. And it's going to give you the current time on your PC. It's going to pick this time from your PC. So if I add eight hours to this, it's going to say eight hours from now will be what 640. And if I change this to something else, okay. So if I add 12 hours to this, it's going to be what 1041 a.m. Okay. If I change this to add 16 hours, then it's going to be 241 p.m. Okay. So that is what we're going to do in this video tutorial. So let's jump right into action. Let me clear this. Okay, so I'm going to leave the hours. You can add anything at all you want. But for the time, just enter equal to now and then do this. Once you do this, just drag this down. Just drag this down. It's going to update the rest of your time. And it's going to pick it from your PC. So now we have our hours. We can change the numbers as we want. But let's get the results. As we have add 8 hours, 16 hours to the current time. What is the result? What am I, am I going to get? That's what we're going to do. So just type equal to. And then we select the current time. Plus, that we have to put into brackets the hour divided by what? 24. And then close the brackets. When you hit enter, it's going to update that for you. So the current time plus 16 hours is going to give us what? 2.42 p.m. If I change this to something else, it should be able to update. If I change this to 18 hours, you can see 18 hours from now will be what? 4. 42 p.m. So that is basically what it's going to do. And we can go ahead and then get it for the rest. So once you select this column, just drag this down like this, and it's going to update the rest. You can see the hours from now is not going to be seen. So all based on the current hours that you're adding. Okay. So when you change this, 15 is going to update them for you. So basically, this is how to add hours to time in what Excel like subscribe and turn on post notification because there's a lot of activities and tips and tricks coming right here on this channel in order not to miss this just turn on the post notification anytime i upload video you get alerts thank you so much let me get your comment at the comment section what you think about this video and any suggestion till i come away again bye bye